<laughs> it's Count Dracula himself. I am the Count of Darkness. I will turn you into iceberg lettuce. And I bid you welcome. Xandor. Vorkov. Vorkov. Keep your distance. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just stay right near this wooden stake here. Here's what he looks like in the movie. Dracula vs. Frankenstein. Man, how do you like being a movie star and Dracula at the same time? I like being with people. I'm encouraging people to donate blood. Dracula takes blood. People give blood. Donate blood. People need blood. <laughs> I've become anemic because I've stopped taking blood because people need to give blood. Easy, easy, yeah, yeah. easy. Yeah. Dracula versus Frankenstein. This is a great movie, man. If you've seen the movie, you know who wins. No. You were on the cover, the cover of Famous Monsters of Filmland. Here's a picture of the cover of Famous Monsters of Filmland. I was Back. Dracula versus Frankenstein. Forrest J. Acker, he was all about this movie. He called you the most horrifying Dracula of all. <coughs> Vampires watch television sometimes. Uh, some do. We have a taste for it. <laughs> it's great talking to you, man. You know, I'm gonna bump that blood. Who is Dracula's favorite monster, anyway? <laughs> Dracula? Yeah. Think about that. versus Frankenstein. A doctor who serves the dead controls the doctor and the living creature horribly created from the mangled corpses of their victims. Dracula versus Frankenstein. His blood is cold, but his mind is keen. He cannot die, for he is already dead. His name is Dracula. Another lives, but his body belongs to the dead. The two will join forces, but only one will survive. Dracula versus Frankenstein. Oakmoor Cemetery is a cold, lifeless place to visit at night. Unless you're already dead, and your name is Dracula. Together, in one film, they meet in a fight of fright. 
the kings of horror battle to the death. Dracula versus Frankenstein.